I mean, there was something that I know you saw the other day, but there's a lot of Chinese papers in yes. your science and math, you know, like there's a problem in academia where you have a PhD in some research in some department, let's say in biology or chemistry or something, and you have another person, another department, another university that don't collaborate and they never like connect the dots between, hey, my research is over here, your research is over there, they don't even know of each other. And you have to have like some sort of collision between like, oh, I could connect right. the dots from this paper from like 1980 and this paper from 2010 combined with my research. And that's how new discoveries get made. But the key thing is like, well, what's hard is because, okay, they're in different domains. You have to kind of actively go and think about this very hard thing to do, but they're in English. Mm. Imagine also another um, dimension where there's a paper in Chinese, it had some discovery, had something. It was cool in isolation, but wasn't like revolutionary. But when right. you combine that research uh, with your research, that's amazing. Like you have like a universal right. ability to I mean, connect this is, the dots. 